Hey, hi guys, I'm going to do a um, Dollar Tree and there might be some Walmart things thrown in. Um, in order to do the um, glitter ornaments that I want to do in some other crafts. So that's why I went to the Dollar Tree yesterday and um, I'll show you some of the things that I picked up. All right, so for the crafts that we'll be doing, this was one of the balls. This is the large plastic ornament. It's very nice. It looks like glass. Um, and then I got a bunch of these. These were two per dollar. And I know I mentioned these last night in the live. They had these, they look like little light bulbs and I plan to use them for the glitter project as well. So I got some of those. And this is the other style that I got, which is this flattish bulb design. So those are for the glitter project. I bought a lot of those, I'll show you. I also bought these little gift bags. They're so cute. I don't know. I may use them for a craft. Um, so you've got the little camper there. And then, I don't know if I bought these last year. I kind of think I did. I bought something like this I was going to use for a craft last year. Um, deck the halls. And then um, Merry Christmas. So those go there. And then they finally got the little books in. Aren't they cute? Now this is the smallest box. I got other sizes. And this is the night before Christmas. I'll show you the other ones that I got. I found one of these and I got this for my son. Um, my second son. For, because he, this used to be one of his favorite cartoons. And it's like a little gag stocking gift. Okay, and then I I got that ornament because I thought it was cute. And I also got this little decoration because I thought it would be cute with something. Okay, and then I got these little penguin socks because I think they would make a great little sweater on a snowman that's a penguin. To have them stand next to the penguins. Okay, and then I also got these glasses right here and these I know I've bought stuff like this before but it's probably I like to use those Instagram fun and stuff and let's see oh and I got this other one for my son that's a gag gift for him. <laughs> and this is a gag gift for my daughter um, I think I do have another one in there somewhere. Okay, two more of those ornaments. I've got a lot of ornaments. I'll show you. I'm going to put them in their own basket. And then I saw these. Um, these are candy cane spoons, peppermint flavored, and I thought they would be great to use with hot chocolate because um, we like peppermint hot chocolate. And I thought, wow, that would be a good thing. Try those. So I bought two packages of those, and they would look nice too if you have a hot cocoa bar or if you just, you know, whatever. Okay. And then I got this. This says Warrior. Um, it's a, it's a DC Comics pen, and so I picked that up. I think I have actually have two of those. So okay. And then... These gift tags. I know I've got other ones that are the vintage ones, but these are um, cute with the jingle bells. And I've got to package some stuff up. And then I got these labels. Very cute. Okay, so let me. Okay. All right. So then I got these for my kitties. Um, these were activity books and they have loads of these stickers. 
that go in the book. So it's it's like a um, let's see. So you can they can put them here and create a scene. And they are in other places in the book. So I picked up two of these. These are stocking stuffers. Okay, I've got to start putting stuff away. And then I picked up one of these just because they have these and I like the designs in them. Like this one, this village house here. You know, and I don't know, I might do something with that. Um, they have a lot of cute designs even to use for stencils or whatnot. And there's also a download of uh, free Christmas music, so I did pick up that. Okay. And I picked up these because cookies and stuff. I need these. So these are I need those. Okay. Let's see. I needed some more construction paper. Actually, I need the yellow for. That's what I use here. Okay. I picked this up to protect my surface when I do the glitter ornaments today. This tablecloth. Okay. And then one of those handmade cards I picked up. And I picked up this gift bag. It says scripture included on the bag. I don't know what they mean by that scripture included. Scripture included on bag. I have no idea what that means because I, here's the bag. I don't know, somebody help me out here. Am I missing something? Scripture included on bag. At first I thought they meant in bag not on the card. The card is empty. Scripture included on bag. I don't know what that means. Okay. And then I picked up this one. No peeking. Until Christmas. I picked up this three pack of gift boxes. This bag, Holly Jolly Christmas. I picked up these boxes. This looks like Ed Asner, doesn't it? I think it is Ed no, I think it is Ed Asner. Okay. And I picked up this. It's the most wonderful time of the year. A lot of the Christmas stuff I had been after I finally found. So we got it very late in our after in our area. None of the cake box stuff. So but I did find those boxes. This is one I actually went to two different. So this is the bigger box, Santa's Christmas list. And you open it up. That's good to you know, you could have it out, but you could also be storing away tape or um, labels, things that you need. And this was Santa's reindeer, and it's the size I got in this. They had most of all the sizes, but I got the, at least the medium size one. It is the season to be jolly. And they all have a nice little reindeer on it, so cute. And then snowflakes. But yeah, it has the very vintagey looking reindeer. It's cute if I put that next to my reindeer. Okay. And then I got, I think this one I'm using as for a gift box. I did get one for myself, a little gingerbread house. Okay. And then I saw these. These are um, just three birds designs and has a website for them, but I guess they distribute 
through the Dollar Tree. So these are Home Life. These are six sheets of stickers for your planner. These are Seasons, and these are Mom Life. So let's see what's you know what they're what's in them. See, it says, "Follow us at Three Bird Design." It says the binders are in the stationary aisle. I did not see them, but I have my own planner. So, you got these stickers. So it's like this, this, chores, and then there's um, game, practice, buy lunch, etc. So I guess you have to, you probably have two sheets, no school. Two sheets of those, and then you have this one, coffee break appointment, life is so good, family game night. So that's the mom life. I should have got... Um, Maybe the season's one for my daughter in the planner, which she probably has. She's got one of those fancy planners. Um, so birthdays, celebrate, Labor Day. Then you've got the months. And then you've got party, celebrate, love all year round. She blooms with greatness. So you've got that. Okay, and then I'll put that back in later. Home life. Come on. Okay. So you've got that, you've got the days of the week, weekend plans. Date night, bills due, no school, make today count. There should be one other sheet. I see unless there's four of those. Oh, there's four. No, okay, we missed this one. Birthday appointment to do. So, very nice, very cute. A dollar. Pop those in there. Okay. Let's see what else we have. Here's the Sims workshop. And these are um, really cute too. I also like can put this out by like my mini tree and then I pack little things from my mini tree like away in them and like little nativity pieces things like that you can not do that okay and this was a new one and I got this one for a gift box the penguins the bakery So I have something that's going in there in the gift box, and then I got, whoops, oh my goodness, this larger one for myself. to there to get some funnels for that rice project and I couldn't find funnels and then last night I found this three piece set so I got these this is for crafts I got these and I got these lamp posts I don't know how they they may I may use them on my houses over there on that little bench too 
And then I got this as a blank. Uh, these are very hard to find. I have one in gold, but I want to use them as Cricut blanks. So anytime I see them, I pick them up. Okay. I also got a 20 pack. I got the old packaging. They have the Crafter Square, but there's only 18 in the new ones. So I picked up the 20 pack. Um, oh, I finally found these. I didn't think they had these this year. Remember I had the flower arrangements in there for the fall? Well, here's Joyous Noel. They had them in three different sizes. So I got those. And then um, I had to get these candles because I have to use those together. Okay, and then I, these socks are really nice. Um, for excuse me, for a dollar, they're they're really stretchy and they feel really good. So um, I had a few of those, very nice. So I picked up I think three pairs of those, and then this is the other box I got. They had snowmen and stuff like that, but I wanted these more classical, almost like cards. So I got those. And I'm going to do some flower arranging. Now I'm going to tell you that I learned how to use my wire cutter on my uh, wire snips. I also got this because I want to use the snowman in one of the houses over here. Okay. Okay. Here's another night before Christmas box. Some of these, uh, some of these things that I'm getting, I'm using as gifts. This little one. Another one of the big balls. A little gingerbread. Okay. Some of these colored twine because I'm going to make some ornaments. Um, I like the red for hangers. Okay. I picked up one of these. I know I picked up one of these before, but I need it for all my little doodads for my snowmen. Okay. Picked up this roll of white felt. And I picked up this white yarn because I want to make a mouse like, well, you didn't see the one that uh, J. Bell's made, but she used that for arms. Picked up this ribbon. This is to go with the glitter Glitter ball project. Picked up these magnetic notepads. Got these for gifts and a gift. And one for myself. I like it because it says shine bright. Picked up. I wasn't sure if I had the white one. I have. I think I have all other colors, but I didn't think I saw the white, the metallic marker. Okay, um, picked up these reusable hot and cold iPads, set for my daughter for her stocking, a set for myself, and set I'm putting in a gift pack. Okay, got this ribbon for the ball project. Picked up these um, charcoal pencils for Luke. Okay. Um, picked up these. I need these for something. Okay. And then I needed some more Christmas flowers for some arrangements. I picked up those. These uh, Valero bath fizzers without uh, chemicals, phthalates, uh, and stuff like that. These are going into a gift. So I got that one, this one, and this one. Okay. And then we're going to talk about glitter here in a second. Let it get out of everything. 
I want to explain all about the glitter. And get that ribbon. And really taking note when I say something, because I'll say something and we'll be gone from the Dollar Tree. I was afraid that all the uh, scarves were gone. Well, in actuality, the scarf that I got last time was gone, but they had this kind, which I kind of like much better, and I wanted to use this one also for um, making the tree, if I ever get onto those little trees. It actually is thicker than the other kind, the Eternity one, and so I picked this up. Probably should have picked up two of them if I want to make the trees, but this will be enough. Um, so I picked up that. All right, and then so they have them in the flat, not just the eternity kind. Like I picked up this color. I think it's going to be a really nice one. Snowmen and penguins. I can't wait to do that. And it's much, like I said, it's much more cost effective than using the socks, especially if you're crafting them for gifts or a craft fair. And I picked up this one. So nice, right? And hold on, I have one other one. This is the kind that I got in the red that I was using. So this is the pink. This is the eternity kind. Infinity. Infinity. Eternity. I guess they are the, the same quality, but uh, I don't know if you get more. It seems like you get more with the other one. Okay. Now. I picked up this. They had these, which sometimes you luck out and you get books. This was uh, the colorful hexacons to crochet, and I mean, this is normally probably like a $20 book. I got one for my daughter and one for me, and maybe we'll um, do that, but I'm going to put that. Okay. And then I got some tissue paper. Okay, and then here's more of the bulbs. Big huge ones. And I have to get my labels ready for my Cricut. And I also want to show you all the blades because I've been getting questions on that. Another set of the two. Another set of the two. And let's see. I picked up this. I picked, I have one before. I have one like on my tree now, but I picked this up for a gift. To go into a gift thing. And this one I picked up for my tree. I really like that. Okay. That another of those pens. Gag stocking stuffer for my daughter. Another one of the big bulbs. Um, Cards. Okay. Let's see. Remember, I needed. Actually, uh, these are from Walmart. Because they still didn't have white pipe cleaners in the Dollar Tree. So I'll, I'll get to that in a second. Got some aluminum foil. I'm going to put that over there. Okay. Alright. And. Some more flowers I need for arrangements. Larger. 
bulbs. And I thought I bought so much, now it doesn't seem like I have a lot of ornaments. Those two pack. And then okay, and then if I would have known, I would have picked up the other color glitter there because um well I don't know. They had this one, it's only 0.5, but it was a really nice purple, so I picked that up. I wasn't I thought like, oh well, I'll be able to get like a lot of glitter there. Now I'll explain about the glitters. And then I picked this up for the bulb project. Now let me show you something. In the past, like I mean the very recent past, we're just out of them. Dollar Tree has had these fine glitters in these little packets, right? And I picked up quite a few of these at one time to go just think about the houses and other projects. Yesterday, only one of the stores had any of these left, and they were like in these really deep brown shades, which I did not want to do ornaments like that. This I didn't purchase for ornaments. I purchased this for the houses and things I was doing before. So this is one of the first glitters I got. They have these, but they only had this purple color, and they had like a different purple, and they were a dollar, of course. Then they had these older and newer packs. Okay, of glitter. So this is the old Crafter Square packaging. This is the new Crafter Square. Um, this actually looks like the that is on something that was newer. Like they changed it. Like they used. To, I thought they. Uh, never mind. So these are 0. 0.5. All together it looks like so it looks like there's point one in each one and these were a dollar so you, you get some different colors this has the red where this one doesn't and this has two gold so I picked that up I don't know if that was a mistake that there were two gold in there I don't know it has a pink and I picked up this one but even these were scarce so I think everybody is making these ornaments so I picked up those glitters because I'm going to do a whole glitter comparison now, I got these larger candles because Luke's birthday is coming up. Okay. I'm going to do some crafts with these. I've got to paint these. And I have some ideas with the Cricut, putting something in the Cricut in here. So I'm going to paint this. I want to do one of those, um, the empty chairs from heaven. If you haven't seen it, I'll link my other one in the video description, check it out. But I'm going to do another version. So, of course, I overbuy because I'm not sure which one I was going to use. Got two of these. And these will always be good for Cricut Designs. I'm trying to do a gift. Okay, and then I got two of like the pedestals. Because again, if you look at my other chair from Empty Seat or from Heaven, you'll know what I mean. Okay, uh, I got two of these because I like these. Uh, this is Messages of Love and Divine Messenger. Um, got two of these. Go into a gift basket. Another pedestal. And then I have this for my daughter, Top Dog Knits. I think she'll like that. She might knit something for the dogs. And this also for my project, if those other things don't work out, these canvases, I didn't want, they had the ones with the wood behind it, but I have to press hard if I'm going to put a Cricut design on there. So I wanted to get the ones without, that were not strung on the wood. Um, these are also for my project. And let me see. Some more flowers. I'm so far behind in my crafting. Flowers. Next.
There's two more pairs of those socks. And you see they're really stretchy. They're nice and thick and usually not what you find at the Dollar Tree. I don't know if that's a brand they're going to continue to carry. I got them at this one where they have, that's where they had the Cake Boss when they had it. And it was in the same end cap. And I don't know if that's where they put things that they don't normally have that are like big finds. Another package of the glue sticks. And I did go to Walmart and these were way cheaper. See, there's 20. If you can still get the old packs for 20 for a dollar. Otherwise you can get 18. And then I need this for that glitter project to suck up the poly um, acrylic, poly acrylic. All right, and then for those of you who said no more containers, I only picked up one, this red container. Okay, and I'm gonna put all of my ornaments in there. I thought I had more, and I know I'm probably saying, oh, I don't have enough now. So let's see what we have. Two, four, this is like a little bit of ASMR. Um, I don't know how to do this. Let me get it where you can see it. Okay. Four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 14, 16, 18, 19, 19, 22, 23, 24, 25, let me see, I'm going to put this down now, 25, 27, 27, I don't think I have enough, 27, okay, so we'll see how they come out. Then let me just consolidate some of these boxes. Oh dear. Oh, hold on, I didn't show that. These are really nice, these notepads, Faith, Hope, and Love, and these are from Crown Jewels. Very nice hardcover notepads. Those are going in a gift. In a gift. It's going in a gift. Um, what else? Is that everything? Well, I've got to show you the glitter from... Hold on, let me clean up and I'll show you some, some stuff. I also picked up a couple of rolls of gift wrap, but I think Jimmy left those in the car. Right. Um, so let me show you more about the, the glitter now. Okay. And I found one more ornament, so I have 28. Okay. So here's some of the stuff. And Jimmy left some of my stuff um, from Walmart. Let's see. So I'm going to see. I couldn't find my poly acrylic, so Jimmy left that there with the Grinch. I guess the Grinch is emphasizing everything. Um, oh, you can't even see it. So he left out there like that, so that I would see it. Um, anyway, this is the polycrylic, and I did get it in the clear gloss. And I showed you this glitter, and you're not seeing that. Done. Okay, so I did show you this glitter. And I picked up this. Well, this was four ounces. This is the one 
that's two forty-seven. Like I said, and the last night I was like, "Ooh, it's expensive." This is a blue um, holographic. It says, "I think it says holographic." Let me see. Yeah. So pick that up. Picked up a green because I wanted to do the Grinch. Um, ones and so I wanted extra green. I picked this up. This is Walmart, the Waverly um, chalk paint for those. You know I am missing stuff because there's something I'm missing definitely from the Dollar Tree. So there's still stuff I'm missing. There's these little chairs. Now you know in the past I've gotten the little wooden chairs but I had to get these little tiny plastic chairs and I hope they're going to work otherwise I think I do have some extra. These I got for eyes. I'm going to try those for the snowmen and the penguins. Get that for Luke. Okay. And then I picked up this cording for um, ornaments I want to make. Picked up a Mod Podge. Okay. I picked up this multi surface. I plan to use this on those little plastic chairs to see if that'll work. Wrap them up with a little sandpaper, maybe. This red ribbon that I want to use on those Scotties with the jingle bell. Okay, this multi surface in red. I already showed you that glitter, that glitter. But this really got about four rolls of this really nice, it's a very country Christmas plaid ribbon from Walmart. Okay, so here's some more stuff I got from the Dollar Tree. I got these larger boxes. These are sets of two. Okay. Oh, this is what happens when you bring in your stuff like this. Okay. Here's a set of three boxes. Okay. Sets of three. Three, two, that looks like that vintage one, Lisa, doesn't it, from Michael's a little bit? Not Michael's, uh, TJ Maxx or Marshall's, whatever. Two, okay. Oh yeah, I got these for the snowman. So I think this will make a really cute Christmas sweater for the snowman. That one and this one. I like those lovely Christmas sweaters. And I got this one. And okay, so now I found what I'm missing just the glitter from um, Walmart. And I got these huge gift bags, three of them. Five of these gift boxes, and this is what I'm going to use for the chairs. There's four chairs in this package. They're not the wooden chairs I got last time, but if they will paint and accept paint, then I'm good to go on those. So I pick those up. We'll see. I'll let you know how that goes. Okay, so let me go through these glitters again. I picked up. Okay, so I've got a different. These are the other glitters that I picked up. These are the super fine, and this is the emerald, and this is the ruby. So we're going to see how those work. I also picked up this um, iridescent glitter, and then, like I said, I have this blue. I have a silver, gold, another green. With the purple, I've got all these. Um, so we're going to try to make those balls here. I'm going to get set up and then I'm thinking I'm going to go live with that, okay?